welcome back. All right, so today, this is gonna be super, super quick, super easy. It is full. I love a good pair of velvet pants. I have this scrap fabric. It's about a yard. It's not enough to do the pants with the waistband attached, so I tucked it under. So I'm just using a pair of pants as a pattern. So you would just use a pair of leggings. If you don't have the flare um, pants, you can just flare out once you get past, a little bit past the knee, you just flare out as big as you want the flare. But for me, I had a pair of flare pants already. So you're just gonna cut around, leaving a little bit for seam allowance. And you wanna wanna make sure that you're cutting the fabric the stretchiest way. So the stretchiest way will go out, not up and down, but the out way, the width of it, not the length of it. So I'm cutting four pieces in total. So two sets of the legs, like I said, just using the other one as the pattern. Then you're gonna face them right side to right side and you're gonna sew down the whole side seam and the inside crotch seam. So the inseam and the outside. If you were doing straight leggings, um, you could cut it on a fold, but because of the flare at the bottom, you're gonna cut it into four pieces. But if you were doing regular leggings or pants, you would cut it on the fold. I have another pants DIY. Um, I will put the link down below but you're going to sew these together like i said the inseam and the out and then you're going to turn one the right way out and leave one the wrong way and then just put the right side one into the wrong side one so that is facing right face to right face line up the seams so you're going to line up the seam for the inseam and along the other side all along the crotch area so you're just setting up your crotch area for this so it's going from waist to the other side of the waist and then it should look like this i also went along and finished off the bottom so i just did the hem for the pant leg you're going to get some elastic if you had did the waist higher you could just put the elastic on fold it in and stitch it but because we didn't have enough for that we're going to make a waistband the same size um i'm making it the same size as the waist is because it's already narrowed in you're going to add your elastic to this it wasn't enough so I made two pieces, but again, you're gonna make sure you're cutting it the stretchy side because you wanna get in and out of it. Take it, fold it over. So you're gonna make it big enough to fit the elastic. Fold it over, put the elastic in, and then you're going to attach the pieces. So you can see how it's like layered there. You'll attach the pieces right side to the right side. And when you're done, it should look like this. So if you have any questions, let me know. But I wanted to make this super quick, but these are perfect for fall. And if you like, give it a big old thumbs up and I will see you in the next one.